<laughs> hey, everybody. Cardboard uh, Moses with you. Welcome. It is time to start our eBay breaks. Uh, we're going to go ahead and start this uh, Labor Day. Happy Labor Day, by the way, everybody. We're going to go ahead and start with 2018 Allen Ginther Baseball. Four box break, number 15. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, it is dark. And then the Moses said, let there be light. All right. Boom. Now, the one last uh, piece de resistance. I got to put on this thing. Well, Jimbo, I mean, you, you know, you, you didn't have to put it that way, but, but thank you, I guess. It's, it's nice to know how you really feel about me. All right, let's put that up. Hey, there it is. In case anybody asks what break this is, they can read that, that tiny, tiny lettering right there. <laughs> uh, where is this? Yep, here it is. Come, 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 come on. There you go. I know I got I got you Marcello I, I got you I got you thank you my man Jimbo do they celebrate uh, Labor Day in Australia I don't know if that's an American thing you know what I mean like I don't being an adult is overrated that depends. It depends on, on a lot of things. Uh, perspective, one. Uh, your net worth, two. You know, if I was an adult, but like a filthy rich adult, oh, life would be awesome. Uh, ZN Dunn, I don't know what you mean there by 2016 tapping. Aliens and Ginsu. I don't know what you mean by that. But this is actually 2018 Alan Ginter Baseball. We're all out of 2016 Aliens and Ginsu. Fresh out, unfortunately. Okay, so you guys have yours in May. Interesting. Mr. Buckets in the house, what up? So, uh, Jimbo, what do you guys do for, for Labor Day over there in Australia? You guys, like, uh, have the kangaroos do all the work or something? Ha! But do And y'all got states in Australia? Not surprised. I don't know. When I think of Australia, I just think of like this. I, I think of Mad Max. I think of like just chaos. It's winter time right now, Jimbo, in Australia. Dang, even even the seasons are different. Nature is crazy. Hey, Jimbo, serious question. You ready for this? Uh, and it's a serious question. So let me, you know, I got I got all these packs to open here. So, uh, you know, I'm looking for some kind of entertainment here. Oh, 
I am ready. All right, cool. Serious question time. Have you ever heard of a skinwalker? There you go, Kells. Kel Kells knows a little something, something. Whoa, Christine. <laughs> I mean, yeah, technically, yeah, you're not wrong. Technically, you're not wrong. Only like 200 more packs to open, y'all. <coughs> uh, I have not. Uh, Jimbo, I have not. I love that Kells used the word lore. Lores, like... <laughs> I can tell you play video games, Kells. Lore says. I read it. I read it in like a like this RPG, like gothic character voice. I should watch it called Wolf Creek. Uh, Marcello, I'm actually pretty close to the beach, dog. Like I'm. Like 30 miles from the beach? South Beach, if you want to be technical. I'm very close to the water. Which is great, because, you know, sometimes I get that, that, that breeze from the ocean. You know, Kells, I was talking to my boys... Because we originally all bought Destiny 2 to, like, play at once. We did for, like, a week or two. And then we all, like, just, you know, one by one just stopped playing Destiny 2. Because it was just, it was I don't know, it was, just, it was getting monotonous. Right? Like, there was nothing new to do. Like, it was just got, it just got boring. But with, like, all the stuff that they've been releasing, I kind of, like, am thinking about getting back into it. Now, my question is this. I have the original Destiny 2. Like, you know what I mean? So, is there any way that I could upgrade that and get, like, the most up-to-date one? Or do I have to, like, just rebuy the whole thing? Because that would suck. What up, DC44? How you doing? It's about a serial killer on the Aussie Outback. That sounds badass. I was watching, uh, I forgot what it was. It was one of these videos on YouTube that's like uh, like the top 10 most like banned movies around the world or something. And there was this one, it was an Australia movie that was banned. It was like, it's like this old school movie from like the 70s or 80s. And if I remember correctly, it's about this dude 
who would like kidnap people and like you know like do things to them and i remember like watching because remember it's like a top 10 countdown so they don't really show much of the film just like clips here and there there's this one clip where a homeboy cuts the um the achilles heel of this one dude that was trying to get away and it was pretty gruesome and it was pretty awesome DC, oh, the Bueller, uh, that's my boy Ryan Melton, uh, I'll tell you what, uh, DC, you, uh, you know our email, right, ripcitycards at gmail.com, uh, you can sh shoot me an email, bro, and, okay, there you go, DC, so, sh yeah, just shoot me an email, and I'll get in, co you know, whenever he comes in the room, because he will come into the room at some point tonight, I think. And uh, I'll let him know, man. Sounds good, DC. The Vlad Super, I forgot who hit that. I think that was in an eBay break. Yeah, that was in an eBay break. It was in an eBay break. So I'm not, I'm not sure who the owner is. But if you like, I can probably do some research. See who it is and see if he's interested in selling it. Which he, he might be, I don't know. Well, DC, I mean, you, 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 you yeah, well, uh, we, like I said, we do have the eBay stuff. Uh, I'm sure you're already familiar with our site, uh, although we have made some changes lately. Uh, we have daily giveaways. We got weekly giveaways. We got monthly giveaways. Uh, tier 1 DC, if you buy it, I break it. It's that simple, brother. Uh, what are you interested in? Because as far as personal boxes, I have what's in the store. But I also have some other stuff that I don't have in the store. For example, I have 2018 certified football loose boxes. I have Donruss football loose boxes. I have two boxes of Elements football. I got Chronicles baseball. And I still have some unparalleled football personal boxes. I ah, got you, DC. Well, yeah, dude, the, uh, you know, sometimes we have high-end stuff. Like, we had two cases of um, Diamond Icons, and we sold that in one day. That, that stuff was pretty, pretty amazing. We need to get some more, some more of that stuff, some more high-end tops. That would be awesome. Yeah, dude, well, I, I showed, a, there were a lot of hits in those Diamond Icons, I just did not take a picture of, of everything one by one because I'm lazy. So I just laid everything out and took a picture of everything. And, like, you could zoom in and see what was in there. But, dude, there was a redemption for a purple Otani. There was a one-of-one one Bryce Harper redemption. There was a one-of-one a one Buster Posey for the Giants in there. That was pretty filthy. Uh... There was some really nasty stuff in there, man. Uh, Ashley, Chronicles number six. You mean for the store? Mm, I don't know. I don't think that's filled yet. Uh, but if it has filled, we'll break it once the eBay breaks are done. Uh, from what I can see, Chronicles number six still has 11 spots left, uh, Ashley. Oh, nice. You hit the Bellinger logo, man. That is pretty nasty. That is nice. I had somebody hit the, the Joey Votto logo, man. That was pretty sweet. But then you got that belly on there. That's nice. 
Uh, tier 1. Oh, I forgot about contenders. I also have contenders, draft picks, basketball. I have not pulled uh, Luka Doncic personally. Um, that product came out Friday. If I'm not mistaken, my partner was live Friday and Saturday. I was in yesterday, but I didn't break anything other than the eBay stuff. So yesterday was a short, uh, short night. So today would be my first look at contenders, draft picks, basketball. And I have no knowledge of what came out of that case. Uh, we do upload all the videos to our YouTube channel. Um, everything titled, of course. So if it's a personal break, we'll state such. Uh, so you can watch those videos if you like and see what came out of it. Because I, I don't know what came out of the case. Um, but it could be in there, man. That stuff is sweet. Yeah, well, tier one to make your life easier, too. Like, so you don't have to sit. I mean, if you want to sit through the whole video, that's your prerogative. Uh, but we always do a recap of the uh, of the hits at the end of the video. So if you want to just watch that, uh, you know, go for it. Save you some time. Uh, do I have any more Bowman draft? I don't know about that. Uh, I would have to check the closet, DC. Um, but I, I think we might have one more case of it, but again, I, I would have to check the case, uh, tier one. Well, I have four, four breaks to do for eBay. That'll take me roughly maybe two hours less than that. I'm going to knock these out and then we can start on the store stuff. Uh, so anyways, let's start the eBay breaks here. Good luck, everybody. I think there sh there might be a rip card in this. Uh, this is the last half. We did hit a rip card last night. Well, DC, no, for sure. Sounds good, man. Sounds good. Komodo Dragon. That is that. Sounds good, uh, Tier 1. I mean, you could you could always you know just keep watching you know for for entertainment purposes, but but okay. Uh, that mini not numbered. Some of the minis are hand numbered. I mean, they're really rare, but always check. Kiermaier, raise mini. Geronimo. Sounds good, DC. Yeah, man, just shoot me that text. I do remember I have your number. But yeah, just shoot me a text and uh, I'll check on that for you. Boom, boom, boom. Oh man, those eBay listings are something else. So I, I can't say I, I feel your pain, but Jason does. And I know how much he uh, does not enjoy it. So <laughs> exactly, DC. <laughs> exactly. I'm not going to say it. But I'm glad you thought it. Bryant of the Cubs, Mini. Granite Twins, Mini. Oh, this is pretty sweet. A little Bueller. Rookie uh, frame, Mini, for the Dodgers. That's pretty sweet. Yeah, that orange Bueller is pretty disgusting. Numbered 1 to 25. It looks like it's in pretty good. Uh, I think it'll probably grade decent. We'll see about that. But I heard if it grades like a 9.5, it could be uh, worth up to like a thousand of them things. Uh, I have not, Christine. I have not. I have not done any of the store breaks yet. Here's an Ian Happ relic for the Cubbies. Once I'm done with all the eBay stuff, I'll get that ripped up. I think we filled that and something else is filled, if I'm not mistaken. Got a little baseball superstition there. What you got here? A red Bueller out of the uh, same 25th. Nice. Dude, there's some nasty stuff out of that draft. That is nice. And it's a 9-5. Holy. F that is. That is. That is nice. That is nice. A 10 auto too. Sick. Dude, that's a nice card. 
I, you know, now that I, I, I have grown to appreciate and learn more and more about cards, and that is a nice card. Kipnis Indians, Manny. Oh, well, Christine, thank you for that. I hope you're enjoying your Labor Day. Mitsui Yankees, Manny. Thank you for uh, tuning in, hanging out with your Uncle Jesse. Let's see a little camp Dodgers, Manny. My thing, DC, is this. Like, I've learned a little bit about products, you know, because I've been breaking, you know, for almost two years now. So I have learned about products and, and you know, so on and so forth. But uh, my thing is, I just, I, I need to learn the sports. You know what I mean? Like, I have baseball. Baseball's like, baseball and hockey are my weakest sports. You know, I got to learn more about them and the players and whatnot. Specifically the players and the rookies, because that's what people look for. Um, but once I get that down, watch out. Crazy whores, many. But I do know that that Bowman is uh, is in a class all of its own. A lot of people love the Bowman. Contreras Cubs Home Run Derby Challenge uh, promo, followed by a Dickerson Rays uh, Home Run Challenge card. Marine National Monument. Got your, uh, oh, this one's hand numbered, as you can see. That's why you always check. Even these are hand numbered. I didn't know that uh, a national monument can number a card. Hey, look at that. That's evidence. Boom. Evolution. That's pretty cool. Uh, DC, I got your text, brother. Thank you, man. This way, I won't forget. The pregame meal. Mini. It's pretty cool. It's like a 10-piece of some chicken. Dude, I had me some Zaxby's on the way down from Ocala last night. Well, yesterday, because it was during the day. And uh, it's pretty amazing. Kevin! Let's see. Uh, dude, Kevin, you have no idea how mad I was. Like, I haven't been that mad in a while. And the reason I was so mad was because I couldn't, like, I couldn't really do anything about it before I spoke to my partner. And we haven't really figured out what we're going to do. I mean, we're debating. Uh, um, I, I would definitely like to take some form of legal action. But, I'm, but I don't know. We're, we're probably not going to take it that far. He's definitely banned from joining any of our breaks. And, you know, I've already instructed the Rip City Mafia to blast his name on, like, all the scammer pages and, and blah, 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 and blah, blah, blah. Z uh, Zimmer of the Indians. Ha, <laughs> DC, you're funny. Uh, yeah, dude. Well, we also stream on YouTube, by the way, in case you didn't know. We, we also stream on there, in case you think I'm talking to myself. Uh, Larkin Reds, uh, Manny. A J.D. Martinez patch for the Red Sox. But anyways, dude, okay, so we give away break credit, right? And some dude, I should say some kid, because he's like this 16-year-old piece of crap. And... Anderson White Sox Mini. All right, you know what? I should say the kid is a genius. He's he's in he's ingenious, okay? Because he figured out a way to. Uh, it's not like he hacked us or anything like this, but he figured out a way, or he figured out the way we you know make up our our codes or whatnot for our giveaways and stuff like that. So since since he figured that out, he was able to like go through like past giveaways and people that hadn't redeemed their codes and stuff yet and he was cashing those in so that dude was getting like free stuff for like m since like february bro this kid was using codes from like 2017 like off ebay like this is not an ebay like situation this is strictly from our website ripcitycars.com we haven't really yet to get scammed on ebay thank god Knock on wood, right? But, uh, but yeah, this is like some website situation. And no, dude, DC, probably, bro. Probably, because I was getting a lot of messages. People were like, oh, dude, I'm missing, you know, I, I know you sent this code out, but it says it's expired. And then I would look, and I would be like, hmm, interesting. It says it's expired, but you say you're not, you say you never used it. 
So then, exactly, being being dread, that that's what ingenious uh, is. He's an evil mastermind at sixteen. But anyways, bro, he jacked a bunch of people's codes. Like I went and looked into the eat like into the codes to see who used it because I could do that. I guess people didn't know that I could do that, but I can. So I went to see who used the code, and lo and behold, the same name would come. Dude, I'm getting mad just thinking about it, just like retelling the story or whatever. So I would notice that like his name would come up a lot, and I'm like, huh, did I email him the code by mistake? Because that was my first thought. I'm like, oh, I messed up. I sent him the wrong codes. That's on me, blah, blah, blah. Uh, Ryan Braun, speaking of scumbags, scumbag Ryan Braun, uh, relic for the Brewers, as Jason calls him. Uh, anyway, so yeah, check the emails. Nope, for sure. He only won one gift code in like the last six months. So I straight up asked him. I was like, yo, dude, did you like figure out like, did you like straight up like just figure out how we come up with the codes and just been using them? And the kid was honest. He was like, yeah, man, you know, I figured it out. I, you know, blah, blah, blah. And I've been doing it for a while now. You know, I'm sorry. You know, do what you got to do. So I was like, all right. And then I just saw red after that. Mattingly of the Yankees, uh, Mini. It, it was it was during a live stream, Arthur. It wasn't really during like a break. So you can't really see the uh, the recording of it. I mean, you could try to watch like the live stream, but you're probably not going to be able to see it due to the fact that we play uh, live music. And, or like not live music, but we play music. That's not light that we don't have licenses to play, so the videos are taken down. Um, but anyway, there's the kid's name, bro. Uh, dude, I have no shame sharing his name. Please put him on blast. Watch out for him on eBay. Watch out for him in just breaker rooms, period. The key, he goes by Eminem Fishing. He has like 16 different, like, no lie. He has like six different, e six different emails. I can't even speak right now. I'm so mad. He has like six different emails. So watch out for that name. I'll put it in the chat. Watch out for him. You know, just just looking out for y'all. Especially those on eBay. If you see it in the chat there, boom. I'll post it one more time. Watch out for that person. It it, it, it is not an honest person. That's that's or at least whatever. I'm just gonna stop talking now. Zimmer is well let's stop talking about that anyway. We got a frame mini here. Who 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 it is? It is Joey Votto of the Reds with a little a little relic there. I'm not sure of his eBay username, uh, Justin. I would have to look that up. That's that's good call on that one. Good call on that one. Let me see if I can find it for you. He probably doesn't even have like his own eBay account, given the fact that he's a child. He's 16. So he's probably using like his mom's or something. But let me see just in case. You know, there is, you know, hell hath no fury than a Moses scorned. Uh, luckily, uh, there is no such username. Or there is, you know, he doesn't have an account on eBay. So I don't know. I don't know his eBay username. I don't even know if he does business on eBay or not. I'm just saying, watch out for that name. It is, uh, he is no bueno. Kluber Indians, mini. Uh, tier one. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I actually have seven boxes. I actually do have seven boxes, so I'm not sure what happened there. Maybe my partner shipped a box to somebody or something. I, I don't know. Yeah, that's this is exactly true, being dread. Freeman. Braves, maybe. Uh, Smokey, what, what, what you mean... Jacob, that is happening after the eBay breaks are done, dude. So, in roughly like under two hours or so, depends on how long it takes me to knock out the eBay stuff, which is usually about two hours. Takumse Mini there. Uh, 
Uh, no, Smokey, I did not. I did not. Michael Conforto of the Mets. Hamilton Reds Mini. I got a lot of catching up to do. Arcia Mini. Dude, Kevin, I was, I was, I was livid, bro. Like I was seething. I was, and it was just making me more and more mad that that I couldn't do, that I couldn't like really do anything about it. Because my first instinct is, all right, let's get physical, baby. But you know, can't do that. I wish, I wish we could go back to like old school rules and challenge people to like duels and stuff. That'd be cool. Donaldson Blue Jays mini. But you know, we're not savages anymore, so I guess we can't no, you know, no. You should bring back the duel. Heck yeah. The Judge Yankees mini. The uh Czechoslovakia mini. And Lincolns are such a fun product. There's all types of different weirdness. Piazza Mini. I like the I like the the little peppers that they have. Trevor Story Mini there. I want to try uh, one of those Carolina Reapers. Wow, Smokey. <laughs> Nola Phillies mini. Don't don't do all that. That's that's that in and of itself is an offense. So don't don't do that. Polanco Pirates mini. Ooh, there's a rip card. Maeda Dodgers mini. Like I said, there probably would be, because I'd be knowing stuff. This one goes to the Mariners. Number 30 out of 50, the Robinson Cano rib card. You got a decision to make there. You going to rip that or you going to keep that? I don't know. But uh, I, one thing I do know is I won't be doing it. There's a cryptocurrency. These go for a little uh, little, 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 little chump change on the old uh, eBay. Probably not, Smokey. I don't know. Like I said, man, the kid's an evil genius. Stevens Mini. The kid is an evil genius. He's probably like that kid from Toy Story. Who like, but instead, he, instead of burning toys with a with a microscope in the sunlight, you know, he uh, he like microwaves insects or something. Like he's just like this depraved child, and then he steals break credit from sweet old Uncle Jesse. Glass now pirates mini. Nope, Marine National Monument mini. Dude, he stole like thousands of dollars worth of stuff. Sid, that's his name. Brantley Indians. Uriel Astros mini. What are you talking about, Kells? Oh, it is on camera. Ha, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Hoskins, Phillies Mini. Jackson Royals Mini. Well, Frozen Rope, he, he figured out how we come up with the codes, like how we do it. And then he just typed in the code. And then, you know, if it hasn't been used, he used it. Seager Mariners Mini. At first, I thought he, like, ha like somebody hacked our email account. And then I went back and checked, it, you know, if I had emailed the, the, the codes to that one person by mistake. And that wasn't the case. Casey in about two hours. 
Uh, after I'm done with the eBay breaks, I got to do these first. Turner, Nationals Mini. So, yeah, Frozen Rope. Exactly. Basically. Dirt Bag. Boom. 9 out of 10. The Yasiel Puig Frame Mini Cloth. That's pretty cool. I like these cloth cards. They're nice looking. I like it. I dig it. Hope you're having a, a happy Labor Day, Casey, and everyone else as well. Ian Hep of the Cubs Mini. Uh, Kells, I am. If we can fill them, you know how I do, baby. If we can fill a break, I'm going to rip it. It's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. Harper uh, Nationals Mini. Of course. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Miggy, former uh, Marlon Great. How you doing, K Daisy? It, I think it has Kells. I'm dude. I, like I said, I got a few things filled that I got to uh, to work on today. Mr. Chief Seattle, many there. CT Giants fan, how are you? Votto Reds mini. Another cryptocurrency. These uh, go for some moolah. Got back from the lake. About to go do a fantasy football draft. Living the dream over there, Casey. Look at that. And I hope when I grow up, I could be half as cool as you. Kepler, Twins Mini. Speaking of the draft. I say we do our draft like... Friday or something. Trinidad Mini there. I think I think it's about time. Many people have clamored for it. Now we could now we just gotta do it. Stu Gods Mini. By the way. If you follow our Facebook group, you, you might want to check it because I am doing a, uh, a giveaway exclusive to the Facebook group. So go ahead and check it out. Check out my latest post and uh, check the details to participate. Do it Thursday. Well, Jimbo, don't tell me how to live my life, all right? Do not do that. Gibson Cardinals mini. Why can't I do a Friday, Jim? Why why you gotta be so complicated? Hmm? Archer Rays mini. Renetto Door Rangers uh promo card there. Castellanos Tigers Mini. Henderson, Yankees mini. Timothy Robert has a Bryant rip card. What's a number two? Miss Plum mini. I'll give you a plum, all right. Chris Sale with the frame mini relic for the Red Sox. It's to 75. Hmm. Personally, I would. But take this into consideration. One, I'm stupid. Two, I'm crazy. Three, I'm not a Cubs fan. And four, why not? Trevor Story, Rockies, maybe? We got Hicks of the Yankees Mini. This is true, Timothy. This that's that's I wanted to leave that. See, you see your imagination made up number five. I didn't even have to hit you with the number five because you already knew it. But that is also a possibility, you know? Like that's the thing about those and and the opposite could be true, Timothy. 
It could be like a freaking Paradise Island mini or something. I don't know, you know? You know, some would argue that it, the, the rip card is more valuable unripped. So then you got to ask yourself, well, do I care about the value? I mean, like, I don't know. There's a lot to consider there. It's a tough choice. A right, uh, Contreras Cubs mini. Mr. Riley. Don't know this guy from anywhere, I'll be honest. But I do know he goes to the non-baseball spot with the framed mini auto. Lincoln Riley, ah, he's a college football coach, of course. How 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 could I be so dumb? I, I don't know. What else we got? I like this little postage required cards too. Guriel Mini. A Ripken Jr. Mini. Kershaw of the Dodgers with a relic. What are you trying to show me here, Timothy? Oh, of course. Showing me his shop. The good old, good old. Well, I see you got that Chris, that Chris Bryant there unripped. That's pretty cool. I wonder if, if, if you, uh, you do end up selling it if the person who buys it is going to rip it. A Mazzara Rangers Mini. Baranac there. Henniger of the Mariners. Well, Jim, I don't know if Jason still wants to do it or not. Last I checked, he wanted to take care of it. So it, it really depends on him. I kind of just want to do it just to get it over with. Squanto Mini. That baseball sweater is so swag. I want that. Amale Reds Mini. Kinsler Angels Mini. Cobb Tigers Mini. Jackson Royals Mini. Come on. Okay. Old Door. Rangers Mini. What do we have here? Mr. Walker. D Bags Mini. Anthony Rizzo, the Cubs, the Home Run Derby Challenge. Kluber, Indians Mini. Mr. Bader, Cardinals Mini. Grant Twins Mini. Steve Simeon. I think that's the uh, the relic from that very sweater. Game used, comedian. What does it take to get a card on this? Like, who do I need to talk to? Because me and Jason, we need our very own cards. That would be insane. We we would we would destroy the hobby industry. Because our card would be a one on one. You know, it's not like we're going to have parallels. Oh, no. It's going to be three. It'll be like three one-on-ones. Three different separate one-on-ones. Each a different picture. Like the whole shebang. Different alias. 
It'll be it'll be awesome. Oh, I can't forget about the printing plates. Gotta throw the printing plates in there too. Alright, well that's it for that. However, we still got the box toppers, which I like to leave for last. Let's see what happens here. This is a Bellinger for the Dodgers. They call these N43s, which is kind of cool. Mr. Robles of the Nationals. Now the big boys. I finally saw an autograph like about a week ago. I had never seen a box topper auto out of uh, out of Ginter. So let's see if we can uh, hit another one here for somebody. This is Chris Bryant of the Cubs. That is uh, not 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 uh, autograph. Chris Fitz, I want to say yes, and I want I would like to do it Thursday, so that the Almighty James Ricketts can participate. His you know His Royal Highness. Has bequeathed me to uh, to do the draft on on Thursday when His Holiness will be available. So of course I must acquiesce. Jose Altuve of the Astros box topper, and that's it for the break. Okay, let's uh, recap it though. So we have a uh, Simeon relic for the non-baseball spot. Kershaw Dodgers, Sale for the Red Sox, Cryptocurrency for the non-baseball, Cabrera Patch for the Tigers. But these cryptocurrencies are, are selling for some moolah, so that's why I want to showcase them in the recap. Vado Reds, Mini, Braun, Brewers, Relic, Martinez, Red Sox, Relic. This is a hand-numbered Marine National Monument, 10 to 25. These are uh, pretty rare, so that's nice. Half of the Cubs relic, too. Autographs. We got Mr. Riley going to the non baseball sp uh, spot. Auto. Yasio Puig, 9 out of 10. The cloth mini for the Dodgers. Rip card, 30 out of 50 for the Mariners. Robinson Cano. You going to rip it or you going to keep it? I don't know. But one thing I do know is I ain't going to do it. And Walker Bueller with the rookie frame mini. That's nice. Autographed. That's a nice one. It's a nice little card right there. And that was a break. Thank you very much. We'll get that out to your eBay.